Oliver Queen. Welcome to Free Comic Book Day 2015. If you leave here today with no comic books, you have failed this city! Alright, Mike here and we're outside of Alter Ego Comic Books for Free Comic Book Day and I am here with one of my fellow volunteers for the costume duty, the lovely Katrina. Katrina Hello, I'm good, I'm great. With this weather I can't Oh, I can't you can't complain. complain. I love your costume, the, the Spider Gwen. Yes, thank you. Where did you come up with the, what was it about Spider Gwen that made you say, I want to costume her? Well, it's nice to see a new character and I've always loved Gwen Stacy and mm -hmm. I hated how it ended, you yeah. know. So seeing her come back and now all of a sudden she's the new Spider-Man, you know, that's mm -hmm. awesome. So yeah. I was like, I want to be Spider-Man, you know, so it, it was just perfectly fitting for me. And I found a place that I could screen print the fabric and sew it up and I was like, this is exactly what I need in my life. See, that's, what, that's one of the reasons why I wanted to talk to you because I, I love doing cosplay, but I'm not going to lie. I do a little bit here and there, but I'm not sewing this. When I find somebody that actually makes their costumes, I have to talk to you. <laughs> so you're telling me this was scratch made? Yes. Oh. And I had to dye the shoes. <laughs> Look at those shoes! It's all about the shoes. I couldn't find any in the right colors, so I had to dye them. But so all of the, the print and everything, what went into yes. making the print? You know, uh, you have to look at like 20, 30 pictures, and then zoom in and send it into this company that will screen print it for you. And then after that, I have to uh, figure out. How look at much, that. Yeah, how much See, fabric you, I need. I had to, to get I, everything. Look at so. I had to stitch a couple of these up one time because yeah. they tore a little bit. I mean, that was just like a patch stitch. Look at that. So, and then I have a mask too, and I have a hood back here somewhere that I did as well. So. What can I say? I'm a fan of you know anybody that has a you know the superhero yes, hood. Yes, the hood, of course. Yeah. <laughs> so, what got you into doing uh, costume work? Um, I'm always a crafty person, so I went from restoring vehicles to wanting something more and I learned how to sew and I'm not one to make blankets and stuff like that so I was yeah. like costumes of course and automotive upholstery but besides <laughs> that you know, <laughs> I'm just all over the place but no, it I, was about six years ago I made my first costume and I've just been going ever since. Oh that's fantastic so. now it's not just you you have this is two generations of costumes yeah. right here. My little raven. Hi sweetie. Say hello. Who are you? Oh. Raven. Raven? That is awesome. What's your superpower? Nothing. Nothing? I Just being know. awesome? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> now you made her costume as well too, right? Yes. Yeah. Now let me ask you, because like I said, I I have nothing but respect for the people that can actually make costumes. What advice would you give to somebody that wants to look into, you know, doing that kind of work, doing that kind of craft? Um, you know, honestly, it's just pick something that you know you love and that you're passionate about. And if you know it's going to be hard, just give yourself time and understand that you're going to make mistakes and that's how you're going to learn. I've never used a single pattern because I don't know how to read them, but I am... <laughs> I, I'm the same way with instructions. Yeah, I'm passionate enough to know that I can keep trying and I'll make mistakes and that's okay. I can just start over and, you know, try to get the best I can, so. Well, thank you very much thank for stopping you. and talking to me. Um, I hate to keep you because it looks like the crowd's getting unruly again and we got work to do, so. We're going to have riots if we don't. Yeah, I know. <laughs> thank you very thank much. You. <laughs> Suddenly you're standing still Your fur is red, so beautiful 